<laughs> what is up everyone, I am Demon Cringe, and today we're gonna to be taking a look at an art thief. Yes everyone, so uh, before we start I just wanna say that uh, I'm pretty sure that you all noticed uh, some, you know, gaps in my upload schedule. And that is because uh, I had to do some uh, personal stuff behind the scenes, and of course I'm still not done, so uh, you know, I just wanna do something a little bit on the easier side right now, but uh, it's still gonna be fun. So this user was recommended by uh, the real Cookie Wolf, who says just a week and this person doesn't fit well in the community, take a look for yourself, and oh my god, the things we are gonna see. So everyone, here she is, obvious gamer girl, a uh, gamer, cute drawings, MLP, Ava the Gamer, female from France, and she's been on DA for just one week. Now, uh, as you as you take a look at this over here, like, I just want you to remember two usernames, okay? Like, uh, this one right here, oh, Honeybee, and uh, this one, DarkyViolent35. Just remember those names. And now let us uh, scroll down and see what uh, see what we have here. It's gonna be, uh, it's gonna be mighty lovely. As you can see, a lot of comments here, you know, calling her out and all that stuff. Let's take a look at this. Hi, I like ponies and cute drawings. Interests, favorite movies, MLP, favorite TV shows, MLP, favorite games, MLP, tools of the trade, ponies, uh, other interests, MLP, and cute drawings. Well, uh, I don't know about you, but I think she's a fan of MLP, yeah, um, I kinda, kinda noticed that a little. So now with that out of the way, let us take a look at the gallery and uh, be amazed at the beauty. You can all see uh, five pictures only, and uh, that's actually a pretty good sign, because that means they haven't uh, been able to steal all that much. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna be taking a look at all of them, so let's get on with it. First off, we have this one right here, and it actually does look pretty good, you know. I really do like the, uh, really do like the hair design and all that. Uh, nice shine and nice detail work and all that. Uh, the line work is actually pretty crisp and smooth, and, of course, the eyes look, uh, very nice, I gotta say. And this over here, this rainbow-haired little, um, other animal version of a rubber ducky, and, of course, the coloring is actually pretty good, you know, and I like the, uh, I like the blending with the brighter and darker color. My Little Pony with Pizza! It's so cute and kawaii! Enjoy! It's not even your DeviantArt on the character's tail. Oh, yeah, I just noticed that. Yeah, look at that. It's stolen from, a uh, Sparky, uh, Sparky, uh, Stilly, uh, 45, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, but, uh, yeah, you can see the watermark, obviously. Steal, do you not have any life? Um, honestly, I think you could've, could've worded that a little bit better, it's actually stolen, but I, uh, yeah, I get what you're trying to say here. This belongs to Des Putin. Really? Des Putin? Okay, um, I honestly don't know what to say about this, then, over here. Like, uh, it kinda looks like, uh, it kinda looks like a first for, uh, you know, this channel right here. We actually may have a, uh, double stolen picture right here, yeah, um... If it really does belong to this Desputin character, yeah, it's uh, probably a double steal. Can you believe that? Uh, it might be, it might be, you know, like Art Thiefception, you know, one Art Thief steals from another, it's just, uh, it's really hilarious. And over here we have this piece, which honestly doesn't have anything to do with MLP, and, like, you would think that MLP is pretty much the only thing that interests them in life and all that, and, uh, seeing a picture like this, I really don't know what to say about it. The drawing itself does look, uh, quite nice, as you can see, a nice purple outline to make the character stick out. I really do like the, uh, coloring and shading on the hair, I love the, uh, you know, blending with the uh, white and gray and uh, purple. I think that's actually a pretty nice blend. And of course, ladies and gentlemen, in case you miss it this time, over here we have this nice little watermark. Take a look at that. It says Hero Dark, and it's actually so small that I, I actually have to lean into the screen. This belongs to Hero Dark MLP, and we have uh, Hero Dark himself uh, or herself. I'm sorry, but this is my fucking drawing and my fucking OC, so please delete it or I report you. Well, Hero Dark, if I uh, if I can give you some advice, uh, please do because it looks like this person really doesn't uh, you know want to stop and all that. So uh, yeah, you gave him no choice. And over here, ladies and gentlemen, wow, uh, this has got to be, uh, yeah, I honestly don't know what to say to this. Like seriously, I don't know what to say to it because it is so small that I cannot even see the details on it. Like, uh, how can I even critique this? Tell me, like you. Uh, uh, just type into the comments. How am I supposed to critique something like this? Like I am really really having to lean into my screen to actually see something in this picture like seriously folks I honestly cannot see anything on the face except for the eyes like the fact that this picture is so small and compressed It actually reminds me of like those old old like really uh, Small wallpaper images for like the early 2000s uh, brick cell phones and all that you remember those oh my god I remember when I was a kid, like, oh my god, these things look so cool, and then uh, years later, oh my god, they look so bad. It's a furry pony, my OC and art cute pretty cat pony. 10 out of 10 quality. This belongs to Emologist DA. Honestly, I actually think I saw some stuff from Emologist, if I'm not mistaken. And over here, folks, we have this, uh, uh this pretty, uh, rough around the edges portrait, uh, yeah, um, it's, uh, 
It's kind of, like I said, rough around the edges, a little bit of squigglies, a little bit of chop and all that. But I'm not here to crap on the original artist, although honestly, they could use a little bit of improvement, I gotta say. You have another watermark, and honestly, folks, I cannot read this to save my goddamn life. Like, seriously, it is so tiny and just squished together. Pony OC, my art, pony mine, and cute. Sorry, this is not your pony, but mine. Uh, this drawing was a gift by a friend. Stolen is a bad thing. Uh, delete it, please. Dude, what the fuck? This is mine, you little kid. Stop pretending it ain't getting you anyway. Where? I swear you're so fucking retarded. Well, it looks like, uh, yeah, Darky Violet is the original artist. Uh, I can't really read that, but uh, I don't know if you say so. And as you can see, folks, over here we have the highest quality stolen piece of art on uh, Obvious Gamer Girls uh, Gallery and all that, and uh, obviously it uh, it looks absolutely amazing in my opinion. I mean, the, the detail work, you know, the shading is just, you know, it really must have taken the original artist a long time to actually make this. And honestly, just like I said with the previous Art Thieves and all that, it really is shitty that uh, people, you know, spend so much time, you know, making stuff like this, you know, making such beautiful pieces and then have someone, you know, just uh, download it and just post it up in like a, over the course of like a few minutes and, you know, the original artist probably spent hours making something like this. Plus, I really do love this uh, scarf over here. It gives a very nice, warm, you know, like a fall season type of feel, even though it's uh, almost summer and all that. Uh, it's kind of out of season, but still, you know, it's a good picture. Honeybee Gift, my art cute fluffy pony OC. Oh yeah, look at that, Honeybee Gift. So, uh, you're saying that you made this for Honeybee, right? Yeah, um... I, I don't know about the validity of that. Oh, and by the way, everyone, before we go to the comments, I just want to point this out over here, the uh, pink poop keychain. It kind of made me chuckle, so I think I'd point it out for you. Hello, last December or so, I drew this as a gift for Honeybee. The artwork is mine, as you can see from the signature, so I'd appreciate it very much if you take it down. Thank you. Oh, over here, yeah, um, it's barely noticeable. It's actually a pretty, uh, pretty ingenious placement of a signature, you know, in a nice, uh, hard-to-reach place, so they can't edit it out, you know, and all that. Uh, so yeah, thumbs up for that one. And of course, here is Oh Honeybee herself, uh, who links uh, Namichi's account, and Dark Violet, who says, Don't be fooled by this idiot, this belongs to Oh Honeybee. Well, ladies and gentlemen, uh, from all of these comments right here, I do believe that Obvious Gamer Girl's butthole was probably bleeding because of all of the uh, virulent clenching that she probably did after being called out so many times. So everyone, that about wraps it up. That's all I have for Obvious Gamer Girl. Like I said, a little bit on the easier side, but still, you know, it's, uh, it is helpful because, you know, they were only on the uh, site for a week and they can get nipped in the butt pretty quickly. Uh, over here, I fail to notice this awesome artwork of uh, Aggressive Retsuko, a show I really, really do love, and I recommend every single one of you to actually watch it. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching, be sure to subscribe and press the little bell icon, and if you wish to support me in a different way, my Patreon link is in the description below, and as always, I'm Demon Cringe, I'll be seeing you guys and gals in the next video.